Hello viewer, welcome to my YouTube channel Software Testing. Today I'll show you how to write software testing test case using ChatGPT. Then there is a question, what is test case? So basically, a test case is a set of action that verify whether the software application is working per the client's requirement. Before AI, software testing test case writing was manual effort. Now with the help of AI, you can write the software testing test case automatically. Like you can take the help chat GPT, Google Gemini and also Bing Copilot too. Today we will use chat GPT for writing those test cases automatically. In order to open chat GPT, you need to open any browser. Then you need to navigate chat GPT dot com. So once you are in here, uh, I have already account with chat GPT. That's why it is logged in. But you need to create an account with chat GPT, then log in, then you will get this page. Here is the message chat GPT. You need to write the prompt. You need to direct chat GPT what you need. So in order to writing test cases, I have written a prompt earlier in order to make a video shorter. That prompt is, can you please write software testing test case for web tool application login functionality, positive and negative test case in Excel table format with column test case ID, requirement ID, description, expected result, actual result, pass, fail and comments. After that, we'll see how ChatGPT works how ai write the test case for us let's verify so you need to paste it over here or you need to write after that you need to hit enter or you need to click this arrow button so let me click over here as soon as you click it will analyze and it will start writing the test case how fast it is take a look it is not even a minute it will finish your test case writing so it is done. Now you can copy those test case and put it in Excel file and we will verify that test case written correct or not. So let me copy from here. Copy. Open any Excel file. Paste it over here. You need to do the little bit formatting like description is we have more word written actual result pass fail and also comments so let me do little bit formatting alignment okay so header row let me do little bit bigger font 14 let me do 12 it is fine so background color it is for designing purpose anything you can do so let me do little bigger so that line will be this is our test case so you can do the all border so that you need to verify clearly basically this is the test case Based on test case, you will test your application, then you will write your actual result, then pass fail. If you have any comments, you can fill up that after testing. Before testing, you need to write those test case like this way manually. So how AI written, let me verify one thing. First test case one, it is requirement one, verify login with valid username and password. User should be logged in successfully and redirected to the home page. Basically, once you log in any application, put user ID and password, click login, then it will send you to the home page, redirected to the home page. That means it is written correctly. If we verify one by one everything, it will take some time. Let me verify randomly. Let's say test case six. Verify login with empty username and empty password. Just click login button. How is it? Error message should be displayed indicating both fields are required. That means without required field, you cannot log in. Those, this test case is also correct. Let me do test case 8. Verify login functionality after entering only space in password field. That means you enter user ID, then password field only space, nothing else. Error message should be displayed indicating invalid input. There is nothing. 
dash means whatever ai written so far i see it is perfectly correct for login functionality on any application in that way you can take the help of ai for writing test cases sometimes we need to write more test cases like 50 test cases or 100 test cases those take a lot of time so in order to save time you can take help of ai to write those test cases but remember forget the proper and correct test case you need to write the prompt properly so based on the prompt ai will write your test case if you write your test case prompt correctly then you will get the better result so that's all for today's tutorial i believe those who will who are new in software testing and writing test cases this video will be very helpful for themselves for writing test case automatically if you think this is helpful please like my video uh, subscribe my channel share it to others also make a comments thanks for watching this video